Hey everybody, it's the Modern Native, Mrs. Native, and we have a frost warning coming in for tonight, so we have to pluck everything that we can, because unfortunately I haven't been able to get the greenhouse materials, because I had to spend money on fencing, which I'll show you guys that in a minute. But, so Mrs. Native is going to be gathering what she can in here, we're harvesting everything, and I have to grab my last little, you know, weed, so, yeah, stay tuned, it's cold. So Mrs. Native is finding and grabbing what she can. And she's going to collect all the peppers and everything else in the middle. Anything that's rotted you can just drop. Because I'm going to be pulling all that plant material out to put in the compost. So I'm going to take... Just you can just drop it down in the, the planter. Base okay. of the base of the plants, baby. Oh, oh okay. Yes. Anywhere. <laughs> there you go. Because I'm going to be pulling all this out and taking those bags down. Because remember, we're going to uh, dig this down deeper. Oh yeah, yeah. This is going to be much better for this coming up. Ooh. Oh shit. Oh, did, damn. <laughs> did it fall down behind? Aw, I hope not. I think it did. I'm going to be so fucking mad. I think I can reach no, it from the I end. I think this is it. Right here. Uh, yeah. Oh, nice. The only probably good red one that I'll find. Yeah. Our next tomato batches are going to be uh, in cages and stuff. Yes. We are actually doing more for those ones. I got a ton of new tomatoes and stuff to try, plus all the seeds left over from this stuff. And we're going to start inside. Oh, sorry. We're going to start inside uh, probably in January or February. Yeah, they'll be early started, like the corn and everything else. Mm-hmm. All early started. And sorry, it's dark, everybody. We haven't been feeling good, and uh, we got that frost warning like four o'clock, so we were like, "Oh shit!" And sun goes down at six, so you had some mini ones right there by your hand. Oh yeah, I thought I saw them. I just couldn't find. Oh, you're going to good. Little great tomatoes, basically. They'll ripen, though. What about this guy? Whatever you see that's good, be my guest. But if it's got a rock, I don't want it. I'm not going to do that. So, these two? No. No. This one looks good. I just have to set that there. It's too heavy. Mm. That's just yep. leaf. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Why'd you do that to me? I was trying to brush it off. I thought you had it. Ooh. I showed you what I was doing, all right? You just brush it off with your finger. It was just a dead leaf pressed to it. It's great. No, I did really good. Yeah, none of those look good. Some of those do. Got a couple back here. Cool, cool. So I will go and harvest what I got to do here and check back with you in a minute when you get to the peppers. Okay. Huh? So Mrs. Native is clipping the uh, the green peppers. They're tiny, but it's it's better than losing them. And if the plants survive and keep going and I'm able to get this covered before winter actually hits, then we'll get some more. Ooh. Shit. Gotta get the carrots, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, found it. Oh, fucker. Oh, damn it. <laughs> In the pocket. I was gonna say, any... No. I think not. Back up, punk. What are you doing in this area, sir? Hey. You do not belong. Come on, Mike. That was cute, though. He backed up. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Sorry, sir. <laughs> they were, like, really tiny. I did not want to pluck these yet, but I got no choice now. Yeah. Not the frost coming. Just as long as the plant is good. You got one hovering right by your boob. It's a tiny little guy. Yeah, I'm not worried about him. I wasn't doing anything with him. Okay. Too tiny to care about. 
Well, so were some of the tomatoes. See them? That guy? Yeah. Watch your fingers. Good ones, oh yeah. Okay. And there's still a couple of green peppers over here. You can probably walk through I the middle of the aisles. Now, yeah. I bet everything's done and over there. Yeah, the squash, especially on that side. Oh, I'm still being careful of the winter squash just because. Yeah, but the base is the base is right there. So I can see. At least I'm not getting light. So. Even those little guys, baby. Grab them all. That one is not worth it. I'll chop them up and put them in a salsa or something. Every little bit. This one doesn't even have anything in it. There's no nutrients. There's no nothing. Just it, empty. It'll be fine. And there's two on this side. Oh, twins. Try not to crack them. No, that was just me cracking the stem. Yeah, they didn't crack. <coughs> okay, some out there stack. So there's the two there. That one even. Oh, there's one still here. Yeah, if it's not actually formed yet, it's fine. There's a little guy there. Wait, and that one? Well, they're not formed, but you want me to take them? Oh, it looked like it's formed. Not really. I guess enough. It's more than the other one was. Yeah. And then there's one, yeah. It formed its bubble. Formed. Yeah, see, if it looks like one of that, like that little guy right there, I'm not going to bother with it. Okay, any green peppers? Or that little guy. There is a couple of green peppers right here. Coming to you. One of my sons smelled very bad. Oh. Okay. So I need to watch my step. Mm -hmm. oh. I gotta some of these See, in here. That's still quite a bit of a harvest. So even if it's not all good for right now, it will be. Yeah, I gotta get some brown paper bags, put those tomatoes in there so they can and the peppers. It's our biggest point in our harvest. No. The tomatoes, yeah. The tomatoes are, but I've already had more green peppers in this. That in the pot. More banana peppers that I can use. And actually, pot was our most harvest. But... <laughs> well, I mean. <laughs> and that's with losing half of our plants. <laughs> so then there's still those guys. Leave me alone. Oh, good, you did it. Why are we new one? Well, that guy actually formed a little bit more. That's a pretty decent guy. I'll make a little bit. Oh, yeah. It's not a bell pepper, either. It looks like one of those, um... Weird ones. Yeah, the other ones. Okay, any more greens? Nope. That's it. Time for carrots. Uh, My I think... trimming, just trimming this. Cut it at the stock right here. I forgot to check about seeding, but they didn't really open up and seed. And I'll just get more. It's whatever. It's fine. We have more. Just... All right. Check that <laughs> out. And they're not they're not long, but that's a beefy potato. If I had this <laughs> more air, yeah, carrot. <laughs> it looks like a potato. It's it's what it looks like. It looks like a potato, but it's a carrot. So uh, if I'd had this ground more aerated, probably would have been able to get. Longer potatoes. But carrots. That carrots, yes. Why I'm, do you keep calling it a potato? I don't know. Good God. Oh. There's going to be a couple that are Ooh, small. Little baby guy. There's yep. Yeah, there's berries. Right here. Demon, stop. Mm. That's not bad. Oh, where'd the other one go? I just said, okay, there we go. Unfortunately, we have to. Yep, there's that guy. A little... Oh. Beefy. Ooh, Look mean, at the difference. Little bowl. <laughs> looks like a turnip, looks like a potato. But they're all carrots. Carrot. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> I just said they're all carrots. <laughs> yeah, that's that's adorable. Is this a carrot? Yeah. It's probably a super stunted one. Yeah, look. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hello, big ones. Oh, I actually gotta dig down deep for this guy. <laughs> oh God, I'm still digging. I'm still digging. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ, I'm actually still digging for him. Oh, that's a nice bundle. Oh, oh, I was digging far for this guy. <laughs> he did not want to come out, but look at this one. Here we go. That's a nice big one. Nice. Ooh, there's the berry. Ouch, you fucking asshole. <laughs> oh. There you go. Nice. And as everybody should know, I'm not afraid to get dirty. <laughs> She's a dirty bitch. I'm a dirty bitch. That's a nice little harvest for, for carrots. I'm did yeah, it for, again. <laughs> for only starting these like a couple months ago. Yeah. Halfway through harvest season. If we had started these in the spring, that would have been so much better. <sighs> so. Got some. Good beef. soil for carrots. Yeah. These would have been monsters yeah. if they got to, to grow for six months. Can you shine your light over here? So I can let these get oh, rest. That's a pretty decent carrot harvest to only harvesting one carrot before all of this. Look at that. Look at that freaking bundle, man. And there's some beefy ones in here. Yeah, they're fat carrots. Yeah, they are fat. Like, that's a whole bag worth of carrots from the store. But, yeah. Uh, looks good. We're going to do a bigger carrot patch next time. All right. A whole world of them. So, bam. So, we have some trimming to do on our harvest. But, other than that, I got to put it up inside so it dries. Because, uh, down here, it has been too damp. Even in there. But, that's not bad for a freaking harvest. And potatoes. A whole basket. And we filled that basket, like, three times it's, now. Uh, this is... <clears throat> The f fifth time, actually. Sweet. Yeah, the fifth. Yeah. Fifth time. That's not bad Still for got harvest. My big squash and my little squash in the back. Yeah. Yep. Haven't done anything with the squashes yet. Mm -hmm. Been letting them ripen, and you can see this one is getting more and more yellow. Yeah, I have to uh, keep turning her because keep getting a little too much. So we're gonna dry the onions. We're gonna let the tomatoes ripen. We're going to can and salsa most of the peppers. And I'm probably going to end up canning some carrots, where we're going to use them. Yeah, the uh, the peppers that are left, I am probably just going to dice them up with some uh, vinegar and stuff and put them in a jar to just sort of pickle, but still canning at the same time. Yeah. I need to get pickling salt and vinegar, but yeah. Yes. Alrighty, everybody. Until next time, remember to get out there, be a native, and go, go beast. beast.